All right, here we are at level three. This one, I know a little bit better than I know level two. Uh, mostly because I play this alone all the time as a kid, like I told you. Uh, level two was never a part of my repertoire of stages that I knew where they were. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now I can kill these things easier. All right, they didn't drop anything. The color is a little off on that screen. Alright, these are the dark notes of this game. They look like little foxes to me. Uh, and so in my mind, I, I thought I called them Fox Knights when I was a kid. I didn't know what their real name was uh, until I actually got a, a manual and it actually said, Hey, these guys' names are Dark Nuts. I was like, Oh, I called them Fox Knights. Because I was a kid. And that's how my kid, little kid brain works. Ow. Rick, why you dumb? Alright, so I know I have to like come over here to get... <laughs> Boom. Boom. <laughs> Alright. I was very just kind of cautious. This one is the one that sucks right here. Oh, I got two. Dang it. Yeah, that was a good bomb. All right, I'm going to save the rest. It'll be a little uh, less active with these bombs. Unless I can get a bomb drop. That was a terrible drop. All right, I'm definitely going to save the last two. Alright, cool. And with this, we have a raft to get us to level 4. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Get out of here. The recording doesn't look terribly sharp. I'm going to take a second. All right, I think that looks better. Maybe. I mean, it doesn't look as crisp as my screen over here, so what am I actually gonna do for a second? I'm actually gonna see if I can, uh... Let's see if the CRT filter will work. Let's go back. Ha! <laughs> that looks so cool. Oh, this definitely looks like classic Zelda. Nah, it's it's annoying though. I kind of like the pixel perfectness of it. Display. Back to 4-3. Alright. Yeah, we're just gonna leave it. Alright, there's no much I can do about it. The capture card that I have is like super cheap. It's bought in China for roughly like 40 bucks. Not gonna worry about it. If this actually becomes something that I want to do for like a living or just for fun, I will, you know, upgrade. Until then, I'm really not gonna worry about it. Like I said before, in this video and in other videos, and I'll say in every video, I'm doing this just to play video games. I like to play video games. I want to play video games. That's what I'm going to do with this. Play video games. Alright, let me check the map real quick. I kind of right. Actually, no, I'm going to kill this dude because I think there's a drop in here. Yeah. Bombs. Always need more bombs, especially for a manhandler. The boss of this, we definitely want bombs. Alright, so for this, I'm actually not going to go through the right. I'm actually going to go down here and bomb the door or the wall right here. Because this will let me to go through. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go one up. 
I'm gonna bomb the wall on the right. And I love that the map of this is just a swastika. Because, you know, that has no cultural meaning whatsoever. And one more. Dead. Look how good that was. I even got a bomb drop with it. Seven bombs. That was actually pretty good. I was really lucky, though. See, I know how to play this game, alright? I told you, I'm actually pretty good at video games. It's just I need to be playing The Legend of Zelda. That's exactly what I needed to be doing. Let's not touch any of these dudes and go straight to level four. Because uh, we don't have enough rupees for the candle yet. And I think we get the candle and... Maybe we get the red candle in four? Maybe? It's not like we need it yet. No, I think we do need it because I think there's going to be dark rooms in four. Oh, I can't remember. All right, it doesn't matter. We're going to try it. We're going to see if there's any dark rooms. If there are dark rooms in there, we'll come out. Uh, we'll see what we need to do. It's when we get to level five, that's when like the problem starts. Because that's the whiz robes. And whiz robes are jerky jerk faces. They suck, in other words. Alright, I doubt there's anything that will drop in this room. Maybe a key? Yeah. You saw that, right? That little bounce off the wall with the boomerang. Oh, yeah. This game is my jam. I know this game so well. All right, I can't, I'm, these guys suck because they don't give drops. Like, I, I kind of judged enemies based on how easy they were to kill and whether or not they gave you drops. And uh, you you need the drops for the sake that they might give you rupees or hearts or something like that. Um, but they don't give anything. Oh, wait. So I thought this was... No, I'm wrong. Oh, no. It was in level three. I skipped them entirely? Maybe it's not level three. Maybe it is this one. No, it was level... I can't remember. I'm, I'm looking for Dudongos. I don't know if it's this little one. Maybe it's in six. I'm blinking on it. I don't know. All right, one of these blocks moves. Nope, nope. Nope. Move, no move. Nope, all right, they don't move, I lied. All right, dark room. Oh, it's blocks. Got it. I was trying to figure out what the pattern was underneath me. And I just like clicked. Oh, it's the diagonal blocks. Right. I got it. Okay, they're all dead. I can make my way up here. This room should be lit. Nope, not lit. But it should be easy anyways. Yeah, just got to wrap around the center here. Got this. Go get this heart. I have full health again. Come up around here. Kill these dudes. Grab the rupees. And head north again. All right, come on. I love it's just all dark rooms. And I can't cross this until I get the step ladder because there's definitely a red river here. You can actually see that the uh, bubbles, these enemies are here, the ones with little faces on them, they're called bubbles. They can't come further down than this line, like right here on the screen. And that's because there's a little river there. So you need to be, you need the step ladder to get over it. Ah, finally I can see you again. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Die, you mini aches. It's called an ache, right? I think it's called an ache. Yeah, I know the, the enemies of Puzzle Little pretty well. Uh, Cause I'm a dork. I hate these dudes. Leg legs suck. All right, this is either, yep, found it. Yeah, I knew it was somewhere. That wasn't too hard. Didn't take me too long to get it. All right, 42 minutes. 42 minutes of recording, only to finally get the item from level four. It's fine, we're doing good. We'll beat this before you know, two hours are up. Up, 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 up. All right. One problem with the step letters, you could definitely mess yourself up doing that. 
Oh, all right. So this is uh, what I call the tea room. It's this real little section in the center that looks like a, a fat tea, and there's two spaces of of water, I think, and you can't cross it. So I have to go down and then back around. And I think I wasted the key to get up in there. So this game is great because it made me waste resources. Like it, it was definitely doing that to trick you. Like there was no reason for it to do what it did, other than the fact to say, "Hey, you waste a key. You know, waste one of your precious resources on this door, which will not help you advance at all." That's what it was saying. All right, you need the magic sword to take these guys out, because then they'll actually drop stuff. Because keys will never drop something. Anything that you can kill with the boomerang will never drop an item. It doesn't have any drops, it won't give you a heart, it won't give you rupees. So we need to be able to do enough damage to the ache before it you know, turns into a keys. Because if you don't do enough damage to the one damage to it, or any hits to it that's not enough to kill it, we'll just turn it into the two keys, which are like mini aches or something like that. I just always read, called them red keys. Wait, I think we get to the eye. Because we could bomb straight up. Yeah. Heck yeah. Because those rupees. Bomb to the right. Yeah. Skip all those rooms. We don't need those rooms. Alright, kill all these dudes. Get get out of here, dude. Alright, I need to put this back on. I'm pretty sure. We have the um, big multi-headed dragon in the other room. I think that's the boss of level four. I'm not entirely sure. But it doesn't matter. Push this block up, go in here, and we're not gonna die. Yeah, it's the multi-headed dragon. We're not gonna die, because we got blue sword, or blue ring, white sword, also called the noble sword. Everyone calls it the white sword, because why not get out of here? Oh, come on, get... <sighs> Try to hurt me. All right, Triforce number four is got. Triforce get. All right, four more levels, and then technically a fifth level, or one more after that.